lecture i am going to discuss about how to generate tdl in data grip so opening the data grip this place and here i am using uh, other tables uh, inside the my sql so here you can see you know, this is a circular or database and inside there this all tables so for uh, generate tdl so first here i am going to select one tables actor right click there then you can see this place SQL script. So here you can get the option generate DDL to query console. Click there. Then you can uh, see here create tables. Or uh, if not exit and here this is create index. Or uh, the name is so this one on circular last names. So index so that's created on the last name. So like this you can select any kind of uh, tables. So this time so uh, going to select here or uh, city then or uh, you need to click here DDL query console then you can get the DDL for uh, the tables called city. So with the help of this city we can create the tables of this. And on uh, this place foreign key generated on the country underscore id. Now on the next stage I am going to generate the DDL on the entire database. So right click on the database then here SQL script again. So this time selecting go DDL query console. And here you can see first that generate a DDL on the actor next here country and create category. So when you select it the database then that generated the all tables of the details and you can also use uh, this place SQL generate so when you click on the SQL generate this will also give the uh, same output this place now you can compare so first is actor here you can see this all those things are similar and foreign key and next is category here you can see this is the category you can compare category and create country here this is creating the country so SQL generate almost same and uh, you can also perform the SQL generate on particular or uh, tables so you need to select then SQL generate click on then you can see here that is generated SQL on the address this columns that's taken and this is the foreign key and for primary key so with the help of this we can also easily an analyze the table has the foreign key or not okay so this is how we can or uh, do generate DDL in data grip so I hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next year thank you